Erie County District Attorney says the use of deadly force was warranted in an officer-involved shooting. Jackie Roberts was at the news conference this afternoon. She joins us now live outside the Erie County Courthouse tonight. Jackie. It's been several days since an officer fired shots at a Conneaut, Ohio man. Today we're getting a closer look at what led up to that deadly incident. 36-year-old Matthew Orenmo was shot and killed last week after what police originally called a brief encounter. But now authorities revealing more information. This is video from the scene at Elk Park Road near the railroad. Orenmo starts skipping and running towards police, holding a black object in his hands. One officer reacted by firing a total of four shots. His Hitting a Renma in the abdomen. Investigators recovered this note near his body, signing, My children do not be disappointed. Police later learned that black object in his hands was a black and silver electric razor. The district attorney says no criminal charges are warranted. The first two shots, as well as the second two shots, when Mr. Orenma uh, sprung up, constituted deadly force. I also find that the trooper's use of deadly force under these circumstances, which resulted in the death of Matthew Orenma, uh, were his actions were reasonable and they were lawful. Police also recovered a letter in Arenma's car from the Cleveland Medical Veterans Center implicating that he had sought out treatment for suicidal thoughts. We also heard from one of his friends who reached out to us on Facebook saying that Arenma was a man of honor and integrity and that he was a great friend. Back to you in the studio. Jackie Roberts outside the Erie County Courthouse tonight.